hello welcome to our next installation of this video i just did a failed video making variables with sound mm, no <laughs> you might see some remnants of it here yeah there and all that sound sound stuff sound variable delete don't want any sound stuff no sound so now we're back to normal okay so variables we're actually not going to do variable we're not going to do variables it's in the variable section though uh it's called list so click on the make a list button we're going to call it inventory here we are ah him okay here we are inventory uh we're going to move it to this side of the screen and now we're going to want to make something the character can pick up so uh sorry this is not what i was meant to do you meant to find it and you're gonna want to find so you can pick something you want your character pick up so for example i want my character to break up a some cheesy puffs cheesy puffs i'm gonna make these a little bit smaller don't worry about this though make that pick, pick up 50 there we are cheesy puffs perfect um we're gonna have variable no not gonna use variables um um broad so forever so when flag clicked forever so this was gonna be a bit complicated hopefully i don't mess up like last time forever if so we can do forever if then touching cats then we are gonna add if touching cat then add cheesy puffs to inventory then we're gonna hide so something else we're gonna want to do just because see in, this isn't gonna make it do this forever it's gonna make it do it it's gonna constantly be checking if it's touching the cat but because it's hiding we can't touch it more than once so we're gonna do it when it starts it will show so let's have a look does this work <laughs> it's a bit slow bless him we'll fix it in a minute so let's see there we are cheesy puffs so we're gonna rinse and repeat this uh and so yeah now we've got cheesy puffs working we're actually one minute guys Sorry, I'm back. <laughs> um, so we're gonna rename cheese puffs or whatever you you made to coin. Then we're gonna go to co we're gonna change the name of the sprite as well to coin. I'm gonna go to costumes. Uh, then we're gonna go to this. I'm gonna look up coin. Oh, there isn't a coin. Whatever will we do? We're gonna get ball a. Eh? Um, then we're gonna copy ball. <laughs> Don't do that. I'm gonna copy boule. We're gonna paste boule into boule. Uh, and then we're gonna make it so it goes in the middle, like this. Sure. So it goes in the middle. Yeah. Sure. 
And here we are. A coin. But if you need a... If you want to put something else in there. Something like something, a little funny thing in here. Uh, like a real coin. But that's what you can do. So we can choose a new costume. Pick a cat to you like the look of the face of. Uh, like a... So let's fly. Eh, you know what? Let's just get a cat. Let's get cat flying. Then we're gonna wanna copy. Oh god. Uh, you know what? Rather than that, let's just delete the parts we don't want. So the body, foot, the arms. Here we are. The head. We're gonna copy. So copy and paste. We're gonna make him smaller. And just plop in there. In there. Uh, here we are. We got coins. Uh, so hmm. you've got a little scratch coin. So if you want, hundred size bigger. You can make sure you can see what he's saying. But hmm, we don't want to add it to the inventory, do we? No. Instead, we're going to go into fails. Not too much. This is quite simple. We're just going to make it count up. So, we now have coins. So, instead of adding coins to inventories, we're actually going to change coin by one. So now, what you'll find is if I walk into it, let's have a look at the variable. Let's see what happens to the variable. Touching cat, change coin by one. <laughs> this should be working. There's no reason for you to not be working. Oh, it's because I needed to start the game. Silly me. Here we are. Oh. He's not hiding. That's why it's going. <laughs> it's going up a bit. <laughs> um. Yeah. Let's just. Let's just. Let Let's just when this da, 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 delete all of inventory. We can just slide that in here, and now we're gonna set the coin to zero. So now, hopefully, this doesn't give me a thousand points, a bajillion points. There we go, coin one. So that's a bit simple introduction to variables. But now we're going to do the inventory. See this one, we're going to do it a bit differently. So in this one, we're going to make something. So we know how to do inventory, but we're just going to do something else anyway. So let's find something cool. For the character use as a weapon. Um, oh, I have an idea. You won't, you guys won't uh, get this, so it's going to go scratch. You don't need to do this. Uh, so let's go here and let's find a cool block. Say, yeah, we're going to make a sword. Out of scratch block. So I have this uh, extension where I can take screenshots. So save. Oh, not print. Uh, save. Screenshot. So this is going to be part of the sword. Something else we're going to need is um, we're also going to need a hilt. What are we going to use for that? We're going to use this. So let's get. this then we can screenshot this and save here we are so what we're gonna do we're gonna obviously delete this so costume 2 we are going to upload these images that we've done uh, don't worry so much about uh, doing what I did uploading stuff 
that's not needed. I just wanted to make it look quite cool. So something you might also want to do if you have screenshotted stuff, uh, paint, just like make walls, just make a border or whatever around your around your block. Don't worry, it all makes sense. And then fill it in with black. Now you can see the white points. Uh, so we're just gonna want to So now you can go here, flip it round. Now I have part of the sword. So now we can delete this. You can get the and part of it. And copy. See, copied already. Delete. Here we are. You can just pop that here. And now we've made our very own little scratch sword. We're going to make this 30. We don't need it. 40. We don't need it that big. Um, so now we have a very own scratch sword. So, now we've got a bit of the uh, inventory system. So, all the inventory stuff will be in here. Add sword to inventory. We're also going to rename this to sword. You didn't have to make whatever you wanted to make, you could do for sword. And then now you're going to want to do when sprite clicked forever. If then touching cat. Add sort to inventory and then hide. And then remember, do the thing we did before when this clicked. Show. Here we are. So let's get our coin. Very slowly get our coin. And then let's go get the sword. There we go. You've got our sword. So that was our introduction to the inventory system. Uh, one thing I'm just going to... Okay, so... Yeah, that's the end of the video. Goodbye.